Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome back to Aces and Adventures. And I got to say, I am still loving this game, still addicted to it, cannot stop playing. We're going to take out the mage here. Plays definitely very differently from the last class that we played. Uh, let's mulligan here. Ooh, not great. I'm looking at what we got here. That requires double diamonds for our ability. So the mage is all about you don't really attack. You just bam your abilities. I'll show you the hero power in a second here. I have a level seven mage, so we definitely got a few more things here. So I just I just leveled them up, and so we now we start with your next ability is free to cast. So if you have, there are some high cost abilities in the deck for sure. And if we find that, we can probably utilize that. So they are surprised. I haven't been here in a long time. Begin the encounter tap. That means they will not be attacking this turn. All right. So instead of attacking, draw an ability, and that's gonna be wise unless you have like three of a kind or. You know a five a five card uh attack or something like that and you kind of just want to keep drawing abilities hmm all right so let's draw step one arcane volley damage one enemy one random enemy twice oh but now i can't play mage armor that's okay i don't really want to play ice bolt since it taps them we we'll just end turn there Ah, Blizzard, tap and deal two damage to all enemies. Do I want to play Mana Main so early? Don't have the card necessary. I guess we'll draw this. Who knows? No, deal two damage to the enemy. Negate their traits until the end of the round. Hmm. A bit scary. You know what? We'll blow this early. We'll blow it early. Why not? I mean that's that just works too well, right? Uh, we don't. I don't really want to play the mage armor. We can probably just end turn. We'll try to kill this thing without using an ability or something like that. Uh, yeah, we'll just spend the arcane volley. Actually, like I said, uh, without using ability, I immediately use an ability, right? <laughs> All right, first level up. Plus one max hand size, max ability hand size. Gain an additional attack. Plus two offense and attack damage with diamonds. Oh. I don't really want to go full into the attacking, I think. Hope you don't mind me skipping all this little lore. Hey. Took one damage, I guess, huh? Reanimate. That means I come back. If they top deck a jack or higher. Gotcha. So we actually have a straight. <laughs> that should deal five here. So it's kind of hard to turn that down, and we'll get to keep an ace. And yeah, no way they're going to be able to defend against that. All right, they didn't top deck, so they die. Uh, we can even spend the ace to ice bolt and see if we could tap them. It's not that risky. Again, we draw all of our... Ooh, wow, we won, actually. When you... In a tie, you win, I guess. We redraw all before we're going to actually defend so it's not that big of a deal probably i don't think i want to bother playing the mage armor here either seems early seal of set would be nice uh why don't we play this we'll wild that so we can seal of set that disables the reanimate maybe i should have drawn first arcane volley for the kill trying to hold on to fireball especially here Rest the ruined weapons from their wretched clutches and claim them for your own. You know what? Let me try it. Gain one HP after a successful attack with a spade. Okay, that's not good for us. <laughs> successful attack? I don't think that. I don't think that counts ability damage. I'm, I I'm very doubtful. Reach out for the gauntlet in the glass. I'm worried it's going to be something similar. Turned it away. Superior reanimate. Pop deck a jack or higher when defeated to remain at 1 HP instead. Isn't that the same thing? Superior reanimate. Defeated for the first time. It is with superior reanimate. Oh, it's more than just the first time. Thank. So seal set would be good when we try to get the kill on that. Fireball would be nice to use here if we could. That's not going to happen. Let's see. This thing has the most 
offense, so let's try to tap that. That went smooth. This way we can hopefully kill with Seal of Set next turn. We just gotta beat a 9, that's easy. Gotta beat a pair of 7s, huh? It's not gonna happen. I want to keep the 5 for Seal of Set, see if we can redraw... Yeah, we don't need the spades right now, right? Who damage there is a little spicy, huh? Ooh. Didn't draw a club. Did draw a fireball. Or rather, a heart. Let's do this. Hmm. I can just go for killing that without Seal of Set. I think we have to kind of here. Come on. Got it. Good night. Ice Bolt for a kill. I think so. Kinda just gotta get these things out of here. But I wanna play Conjured Cloak. I think I'll hold on that. We got this, right? Alright, defend with the queen. Very nice. Arcane Volley for a kill. Do I uh it's probably you know what's actually probably good here? Killing with a pair and holding on to our abilities. Well, before I do that, well, no. It's just because Arcane Volley is pretty good. It's very unlikely it could defend this. Oh, it was close, though. <laughs> oh, it top decked. Oh, for crying out loud. All right. <laughs> Can't attack again. All right, fine. Now I'll use Arcane Volley. All right, plus one defense. Top deck a red card when defeated to remain at one HP instead. Me defeated? Unlikely. Plus two max health, plus one defense per heart in your hand. Your hearts deal plus two defense damage. Let's go ability damage. From the wood. I think you might want to... Uh... Hmm. I might just want this, I'm thinking. Ditch the armor. Hmm. Plus one defense is alright. Get rid of the mage armor, though. Okay, we don't need offense since we use abilities. I think a lot of these, uh, even though one of those was a uh, higher level, I guess you could say it, it's just from leveling up. It doesn't necessarily mean it's better. Seems like you might want to like uh, form your deck around it more. The offense and defense of enemies with life force are equal to their current HP. Okay. So, Seal of Insight. That's now disabled. Now it's a 1-1. One, one. If I attack here, it's 3 damage. Do I want to do that? So now I probably wouldn't even want to try to kill this thing. I don't think. Freshman. I don't think I want to attack. Age armor I can't play. Do Flash of Insight. Draw 3 abilities. Kind of open for a biggie here. Let's try to tap something here, shall we? I still have two kings, I guess. Nice. This way, this thing probably won't really be able to do much to me. So this is the only real danger at the end of this turn, right? Uh, yeah, I don't. I want to save those kings in case we get feist up here or something. I'll defend with a spade. We got three kings even. Aha! That's why you save, right? I want to keep the... Hmm. I already have another heart. I'm trying to think of which ones to keep here. That's fine. Okay. Good fireball, right? Boom. Anything I need to do before that? I don't think so. Four damage each. Let's see... What do we want to do then? No refreshment. Let's draw an ability. Okay, let's see if we can just defend for the win here. What color, what color cards do we want to keep here? I guess the diamond? I think the diamond over the club. Well, here we go. That's fine too. Done's out. What? 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 <laughs> Alright, let's level up again. This is the final level for this one. Reduce the cost of your abilities by one. 
That's crazy. It's kind of like randomized if things are asked. If it asks for more than one type of card. Lower the game volume a touch here for us. Okay, so what do you got here? Red cards deal plus one combat damage. Black cards deal one combat damage. Huh? Does that say minus one? Minus one. So this is actually affects our abilities too. So red cards steal more. Easy. What's Siphon do? Heal equal to the damage they deal with a standard attack. Okay. That's fine. Fire, deal two damage to an enemy. Draw a card. Bend a diamond or mage armor. That's fine. Let's draw another ability. Play the flame again. Over, draw three cards. Allows drawing over your max hand size. You then select excess cards to discard. Can't attack, so that doesn't really make sense here. If I want to gain a shield. Maybe not this turn. Singular ace, and it deals zero damage. So I guess I just defend with something else, right? Because I can't beat an ace. I can't make them take the damage. If that makes sense. Hmm. I could make like three of a kind here. I could make... Yeah, not, not that much. I mean, we got a pair of aces, but it's just not that good, I'd say. Draw an ability. Fireball. Kaboom. Yeah, these are all these all just kind of manipulate the suits and the cards a little here, huh? Guess we just end turn here then. A singular king. Use an ace. Man, I just can't get anything useful here. <laughs> I have to spend one though. Eight, nine, ten. Did I already play that? I did not. Okay, here's what we do. We wild the ace. I think it'll know to turn it into a jack here or whatever. It only hits for two. <laughs> no way they're gonna beat it. Can't even tell, really. Because of Steamy. Oh, it healed me, though, so that's kind of nice. Might be a decent time to overdraw three cards. Through the Joker. Was it a decent time? I don't think it was, actually. With the reduced cost of the abilities from that level. Oh, crud. Uh, gain one shield, draw a card. Hmm. Gain one shield, draw a card. No point in using that Joker, huh? Oh, it did get the Siphon, though. I can't even play Blizzard? You gotta be kidding. Ah, yes, we can. Let's just uh, do both of those for the Blizzard here. Then I'll tap them. Let's see. Draw instead of attacking. I could play Triple Jacks. Hmm. Because of the Joker, right? Still is only going to deal... Actually... If I do that, how much damage is that? It's still only two? It says red cards deal plus one combat damage. Hmm. Confusing. Here we go. Draw three abilities. <laughs> Pretty decent draw there. Uh, They're already tapped, so I guess you wouldn't Ice Bolt, huh? Yeah... Actually, you can wild this to double jacks for a second blizzard. Oh, and I think we win, right? That's lethal. Is it? It is. Run done. Probably much shorter than the last one. I think that was the boss, right? That it was, and that was the mage. The mage is a lot of fun spamming abilities over and over, I gotta say. Uh, highly recommend. Here we go. Use the straight in combat. We completed that mission. 
Got a rank A. It seems like the rank is based mostly on your completion time. Like, I completed one mission in, like, three minutes, and I got an S+, plus, I think. Yeah, I like that. It's fun. There you go. Short. Hopefully satisfying mission for us there. Anyway, that's it. Like, comment, subscribe. If you guys know the deal, let me know what you think of the game in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video. All right. Bye, everyone.